This gets better evening is brought to you by NFA Air and takes place in a catch weight of 158 pounds. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. He represents Team Lionel Waterford and tonight he makes his mixed martial arts debut. Give it up for Owen Hennessy! And introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. He represents SPG Mace and brings him to the cage a record of no wins and one defeat. Please welcome Owen McDonald! He is training six years, so one of these guys that tra started training as a kid. So and we're um, going to see a lot more of that as the years go on. You can absolutely, see it now, yeah. we're starting to see these guys come to the arrive in the adult scene now with more experience than a lot of the adult amateurs. Nice, nice high kick! Woo! Head kick straight off the bat by Hennessy. He's got striking too. Yeah, that left hook, right hand was very quick. High oh. guard and a straight right by McDonald. Lovely Here entry there, the takedown. and McDonald sprawls beautifully. Oh, these Great guys are getting kick. after it straight away. Neither of these guys want to see three rounds. Big swing of a left hand by McDonald. Both guys light on their feet to begin with here. There's a nice pace to this one. Nice overhand right. Beautiful work by McDonald. Great leg kick. They're letting the shots fly. Nobody's showing any signs of uh, of inexperience or nerves just now. Great counter strike there by Hennessy. Yeah, and they're standing kind of in the pocket too. There's not a lot of space between the fighters, so they're both there to be hit. If you're going to land shots, you got to get in close and get in a vulnerable position to do it. And both guys seem to know that, and they're they're not really uh, hiding from it even they though we've got a big cage they have quite a similar striking kind of mm. yeah both guys mixing up their weapons very well and right now that orthodox stance them high kicks are nice yeah and he's he landed the first one but he, that was a heavy strike the rest heavy have hook. been checked and the hands of mcdonald are uh they're heavy. Finding a home. Mm. He's pressing the action here. He's keeping Hennessy moving around that cage, and he's he's on the front foot. Hennessy enters again. Great defense again. That's two really impressive sprawls by McDonald so far. He moves those hips very, very well, reacts well in those situations. Just a reminder, Hennessy's in the green shorts and McDonald in the black shorts for anyone watching at home. Yeah, a battle of the Owens here. Nice stick and move by Hennessy. Show good lateral movement so far. See some redness on Hennessy's stomach from some kicks. Yeah, there's been plenty of uh, impactful shots so far in this first one. Nice right hand by McDonald again. He's using that jab really well to gauge the distance and then finding the home for that right hand a lot. You can hear Hennessy's corner calling for more body shots. Very, Great very first impressive round. first round. Both, both, both guys are moving very economically, <laughs> neither breathing heavy. Both light on their feet, they're both bouncing on their toes here. There's a lot of experience with both these young guys. It's extremely impressive. Yeah. Uh, you can see both of them are uh, not showing any signs of being a beginner, you know? No glove touch. Looking to just time the struck. And they're both straight back into the pocket. McDonald just wants to close that space and really get into that boxing range. And he's managed to now straight away at the start of this second. He's staying on Hennessy. Hennessy moving laterally. Nice inside leg kicks to try and get away, but McDonald not giving him any breathing space so far. McDonald is great, he's finishing most of his combinations with a kick, which is yeah. extremely nice. Yeah, and still it manages that sprawl. He's touching, touching, touching a lot with these hands. Lovely head movement by McDonald, beautiful work. Right hand from McDonald came over the top at the end of that combination from Hennessy. Hennessy's on the back foot. 
a lot up against the cage, being being walked around the cage almost. Yeah, absolutely. McDonald leading the charge here. Very calm, measured, calculated striking performance. He's getting into this boxing range. Yeah. He's very Great strong. Great head here. kick. Yeah, brilliant head kick there. Good feints. He, he he's doing this this fake with his right constantly, and it's Hennessy's reacting to it. Yeah. Yeah, he feints very well. His head movement's good. Short left hook he's using, and then those combinations he's finishing a lot with the right hand. I'm very, very impressed with these hands. And just his general boxing style has been crisp. Ooh. Just missed. When you're oh, lovely jab pops the head of Hennessy back, finds a home with that right hand. When you're the one pressing the action, the guy doing the backward step all the time can get tired very quick because that's quite hard on your quads, your gas tank. You use a little more energy fighting off the back foot than you do off the front. There's a little bit of pop coming off the shots. You can see as they're moving halfway through round two, as to be expected. Yeah. But it's all about touching them up. It's been a high pace, this one, so far. Hen McDonald is not giving Hennessy any breathing space here. Not allowing him to circle out and reset. He's just there all the time. Every time Hennessy does this, McDonald's there. There's no fear in Hennessy though. He's not afraid at no. all. He's he's keeping his cool. Yeah, he's, he's doing the right thing. Just a difficult style to come up against this pressure style. If he can get off the cage, get more in the center, he might maybe get a takedown if he shoots shoots for another takedown. Absolutely. He's yet to prove successful with any of his three attempts, but it only takes one if you can get the finish once you get the guy down. But very impressed as I keep saying with McDonald, his timing of his striking and his precision. That was very close, another head kick. These 70 kilo fights are always exciting. There's always loads of action, yeah. loads of stamina. Really impressive second round by Owen McDonald. Here we go. Third and final round is upon us of what has been an absolutely excellent bout between Owen McDonald in the black trunks, Owen Hennessy in the green. No but doubt these guys are gonna leave it all here in the cage for us tonight in this last round. Yeah, McDonald's yeah. stepping straight forward into the into the grill of Hennessy straight away at the end of the, at the, at the beginning of the third round. Checks that leg kick nicely and Hennessy's coming out a bit stronger, a bit more. There we go. Oh, great takedown defense that again. Take Amazing. Defense. Just when it looked like he was finally down, still manages to scramble free. And it's going to be harder and harder as they get more tired and they get more sweaty to get these takedowns as the as That's the it, yeah, he seemed to just slide right out of that one, didn't he? Maybe a body lock takedown might be the move. As he said, very difficult to very difficult get a hold of someone now with three rounds. And these shots are landing heavy. Yeah, the combinations, the way he finishes with hooks, very impressed, and that right hand found a home. See. Lovely slip and rip to the body by McDonald. Beautiful work, the hands have been Unbelievably impressive over the three rounds. Again, left hook to the body, excellent work. He's doing great work on the body. Oh. Now we're on the ground with some ground and pound. We've got McDonald on top. Yeah. We'll see We'll see how uh, Hennessy might work off his back maybe now. Yeah. See how the jiu-jitsu comes into play or is he gonna stand him up? Speaking as a jiu-jitsu guy, jiu-jitsu becomes a lot less effective once you're taking a few clatters to the head. And your gas tank is starting to drain down. Becomes a little harder to execute your skill set. McDonald is relentless here. He looks like he could go for 10 rounds. Lovely right hand, digs to the body with the right hand again. Let's the right high kick fly. Hennessy struggling to get away a little bit here. We're finally seeing signs of Hennessy struggling and he's, he's wearing a lot of these shots now and McDonald ain't letting him off the leash too easily. His hands are down, he's getting fatigued. And you can see McDonald's keeping his hands up constantly. Yeah. Doing fakes. His fundamentals are impressive. His timing, his precision, his pressure. I'd be surprised to hear if, if he doesn't have a Muay Thai or a boxing background. His yeah. striking is phenomenal. Without a doubt, a little overhand right just clips Hennessy on the way out there. He's actually running after him. Yeah. 
He doesn't want to give him a second to breed. Yeah, staying in front at all times. As I said, it's so exhausting dealing with someone doing this to you. This Nate Diaz style of pressure, pressure, pressure. Or even Nick Diaz was a bigger exponent of this style. And as I said, McGonnell looks like he could do this all night long. Hennessy, however, seems to be buckling just a little bit. Big shots to the body. McDonald, a beautiful right kick to the body. His head movement and everything, he's moving yeah. out of the way of any oncoming shots. Yeah. Great knee to the body. Just Brilliant levels fight. above in the strike, and what a performance. Great blown performance. away by the quality of Owen McDonald this evening. What an excellent striking performance we just witnessed. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to your judges' scorecards for the decision. All three judges score this bout, 30-27, for your winner by unanimous decision, Owen Mann!